So let me go across to Deepak. Deepak, I can see a lot of enthusiastic school children behind you. What's their understanding of why this day is going to be so very significant? A day of history that we all will remember. Well, we're here at uh, the Orchid uh, School in uh, Bengaluru's uh, Jalali and, uh, you know, the school had given a, a couple of tasks to the students. One of them is to make miniature models of the Chandrayaan project. They had also given them a task of writing letters to ISRO, making videos as well. I have a bunch of students here with me who've done uh, most of it and a uh, lot of models that you're looking at all around from your PSLV, uh, you know, rockets to uh, the Pragyan rover to the orbiter and even the lander in itself. They've made multiple models. Uh, the, this is a part of an assignment of sorts that was given to them, but they've had more fun than it being a very serious assignment for which you know they have uh, probably given marks for. So let's try and understand what are these models, each and every one. Speak to some of the students here, and uh, here you can see, of course, a simple globe uh, which they have right now, you know, converted into a, a, a demonstration of sorts where you can even see uh, the satellite going around the Earth's orbit. If you would explain what this model is. So this is the Earth's orbiter, like basically when it was around the Earth, it was like this. So that's what we are trying to convey. So with the help of Earth's gravitational pull, the orbiter is entering the lunar orbit. So that's what we are trying to demonstrate here, the lunar orbit, it's surrounding the Earth. What have you made and if you could show us your... Sir, we both have worked on the same, on the same project. Who's made uh, the rover? Uh, I... Somebody here who's made the rover is behind, okay. What, and you have made something very interesting. I'll ask my video journalist Santosh to come closer. He's made uh, the entire, uh, you know, uh, rocket ship out of a uh, pencil, pencil lead, I believe. How can you tell us how you made it? This so, uh, show us that as well. And uh, this Chandrayaan model I made in pencil lead. Okay. So it's uh, two centimeter in length, and I made the rover also. Okay. This is just one centimeter. I took some one to two hours for making this, and it was a little bit complicated because of the sticking part. And it was easy. It was easy? Yeah, it was easy. Okay, let's speak. Uh, if you could make a little way so that I could speak to the others as well who've made some of the creative models now. Uh, we should understand that as far as uh, uh, the rover is concerned, if it does manage to come out, that would mean that, uh, you know, India has achieved what uh, the target was. So, you know, there are multiple of them making these rovers. If you could take us through this design. So, this design is like, I've made this rover right here. So, this is purely made out of cardboard. And uh, like the solar panels over here, the camera uh, on which when the rover is going to touch the surface of the moon. So like it's going to take everything, like the temperature, the water, everything is going to click pictures. And these, these are the wheels right here made purely out of cardboard. And there's Indian flag stuck. And uh, yeah, that's it. Okay, what it's have all. you made? Like this is the Pragyan rover and uh, it is like working model. Okay. Like, you uh, got a remote as well, so it moves? Yes, yes. Can you sh show us? Wow. Well, he's also made a, a, a surface here which yeah. probably, uh, you know, replicates the moon's uh, surface as well. Yes. So it's quite interesting. So move it around. Let's see if, uh, you know, if, are you hopeful that, you know, the ISRO scientists will be able to do this on the moon today? Yes. Yes. And what have you made? I have made a satellite out of a bislary bottle. Uh, I used this polythene ball and I sticked it on top with the Indian flag and this solar panels over okay. here. And what about you? You've also made uh, the rover. Yes. So this is, again, the Pragyan rover and its purpose is to explore the South Pole and get uh, important information because the territory is largely unexplored. So we have cameras here, we have a solar panel, and the experiment life will be one lunar day, which is 14 Earth days. Well, you definitely see, of course, among uh, the students here, the enthusiasm and, uh, uh, you know, somewhere uh, uh, they do have these sharp minds to ensure that they know the design, they understand it, they've, they've read about it and then uh, they've replicated most of it. And here as well, multiple interesting designs as my video journalist uh, Santosh continues to show our viewers. Uh, if, who, who has done this? I, I believe it's by Dia, Priyanka, uh, Swarantika and uh, Rit uh, from Glass 8. Anyone of you here who could explain this? Okay, they have gone back to their classes. What have you all made? I can see some batteries connected to uh, the PSLV here as well. So basically this is a PSLV lunar launch vehicle. We have made out of this with paper and some sticks uh, and we have attached some LEDs to to looks basically. Okay. So this was recently launched on 14 July and today is the landing. So let's hope for the best. Okay, and what about you? What have you made? So I have made the model of the launcher, which is the LVM-3 launch okay. vehicle Mark III. Okay. okay. So well, uh, uh, towards the end for all uh, the scientists at ISRO, would you all like to say something? Would you all like to say something? Yeah, yeah. Good luck. Good luck. Yeah. Yeah. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Well, they all say all the best and, uh, you know, definitely the excitement is quite high here, just like it is across the country.